Join Aegean Odyssey in January 2016 as she sails from South Africa to Asia via the Indian Ocean on a 26-day voyage that is certain to leave you with lifelong memories. You will meet Aegean Odyssey in Cape Town where two and a half days of exploration await, including city sightseeing and a cable car ride to Table Mountain and optional full day excursion to the Stellenbosch wine estates. From Port Elizabeth you will visit the Addo Elephant Park, housing more than 600 elephants. The game drive through the park is a superb chance to get up close to the reddish Addo elephants and a variety of other game including lion, hyena and cheetah. On January the 23rd, you will find yourself in Richards Bay, the gateway to the Luluwe Game Reserve and St. Lucia National Park. Your first day of wildlife spotting will be at Luluwe, well known for its small population of the rare white rhino and a spectacular variety of bird and animal life. A cruise on St. Lucia Lake the following day will provide you with the best views of the nesting sites of crocodiles and hippos. Your call to Mayotte follows three days at sea and our tours allow you to explore the beautiful southernmost island of the crescent-shaped Comoros archipelago. Included tour options are the boat trip to Le Petit Terre for a feel of its colonial past or the eastern coast of Mayotte with its pristine musical beach and botanical garden. Mahé is the largest island of the Seychelles and is a true tropical paradise. Sightseeing includes the capital Victoria and a drive to Saint Souci Mountain. Aegean Odyssey will remain in Mahé overnight and give you plenty of time to explore the charms of the island or opt for a coral cruise to the reef barrier. On the day after, we reach La Digue, blessed with warm azure waters and beautiful beaches. You can also tender across and spend some time in Prala, one of the two places in the world able to grow the famous Coco de Mer palm tree. Your next three days will be spent at sea during which time you will mark the crossing of the equator with a traditional crossing of the line ceremony. In the distance, your next port of call awaits. The uninhabited island of Cuda Bandos. The ideal stop for a beach barbecue and a day of relaxation. Once you arrive in Colombo, Sri Lanka, the overland part of your itinerary begins. Enjoy a two-night hotel stay and included tours to Kandy, Petar Bazaar and Aso Karamaya Buddhist Temple before embarking on your journey home. Guest speakers on this voyage are Peter Morby, a wildlife lecturer, ornithologist and research ecologist. Simone Schofield, a native crafts tutor. Andrew Schofield, ecologist and Dr. Richard Thomas, an expert from the UK's Department for International Development. <laughs>